Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's start. Prepare mm. a story, uh, guardian angel, how he started off. Mm. Mm. How? How you started off. Takatu wants yeah your life. Paka vilevilevi um, yeah into gospel. Um, how I started music or um, music, music, music. Uh, basically, uh, music. Um, mm. music nearly at the nikiwa high school. Eh? Mm, high school. Shule gani yu? Nearly at the nikiwa hospital here. Okay. So I found the nearly at the music. Mm-hmm. I love for uh, for two uh, for three look at the spell. Uli fukuzo shule uli fanya Hey hey okay. Shule ni kwa kichwangu ni nambai. Wow. Ni kwa hiyo time na imbanga sometimes to say kila say kila and gospel. Okay. So from one do ni leandi kada the first song. I mean after the leanda. Mhm. Mhm. Mamba ni zikia. So ni kwa liwa ni kenda kaiole. Okay. So Kayole nika ndele hapo kufanya music hapo. Mhm mhm. You know from 2 from 3 at least uh, by the time na fika from 3. Mhm. Music ile ilikuwa imesha kwa as in hiyo sasa the new generation ilikuwa imeshika shika. Okay. So nika meet na DK. Mhm kuna jamaa ali ni introduce kwake akanipeleka studio mm-hmm. and then i recorded my first song mm, okay the first song was in a dry surrender ah okay yeah so then after that i also recorded another one when i was still in high school in Tommy Jim Grace mhm then now when i cleared high school ni ka get to say when you are willing to support because already ni kwa poa okay so ni kaketo so alikuwa willing to support na video mm-hmm, and uh, mm-hmm. we can find video here yeah, amazing great for that so that now amazing great was my debut song kabisa kabisa now into the industry mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. okay yeah. that's nice now mm-hmm. kuna fununu yeah. hmm? that uh, yeah. you had an experience as a street boy sometime back before you got to yeah, music yeah i was yeah i was in street but um at the age of i think 11 mm-hmm. 10 11 okay. yeah to be your story dogo 10 um um you know how guys you know be and, and my mother to go to dogo she the shit okay so at some point she got attacked she didn't have a job life is a kwa hard kidogo mhm so i think i just uh, go to a place where i felt uh, Okay. This lady is going through mashida kwa sababu yangu. So, what I mean is to. Mhm. Yeah, so that's the point where I went to the street. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And uh, now has how has been your experience in the gospel music scene so far? Ever since know, Wanzi. Uh, um it the gospel is really hard. Huh? Mhm. The gospel is really hard because of um Uh, well, the people's expectation and, and and I would I wouldn't I wouldn't uh, say the gospel I would just say the industry because you know there's no gospel and in particular industry. Mhm mhm. Uh the industry is the same. We have the same fun. Yeah, true. Those people who listen to me and the same ones who listen to even the secular artists. Mhm mhm. But uh people's expectations for a gospel artist are you know a bit high. Okay. And of course uh, where the industry is uh, there's no uh, there's no you know um stream of money that uh, that mm-hmm. is clear okay like atu 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 na biashara ile tunajua kwamba kwa industry inatoa dopo ya muziki ati itakuwa consistent poka ati iko consistent eh oh. leo unaweza pata kidogo ama ukose kupata okay Uh, so is that uh, why kuna time uh, when tulipata info that you were all, you almost gave up on music Yeah, I was not giving up at because we are sana sana at do but I was giving up cuz now it, mm-hmm. it didn't make sense you know you have to struggle to put out music mm-hmm. the music sometimes does not even get a play oh, okay you know uh, you uh, una do maybe una unapata kidogo ya kutoa one song the next song hautapata hata do ya ku release another song mhm mhm 
because yani hauna you know umesota mafanzo wako maybe wanafikiria kwa 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 wamekuwa na kati hivi na coach hivi pe anapatia anga watu expectation wana na mtu wako sawa you know so it it was a whole lot of struggle even mm. more than uh, uh, something that you enjoy doing okay so at the end of the day you need to also do something ukijua okay, at least mm-hmm. you have hopes for the next project at mm-hmm. least you can be able to you know sustain yourself even through it because Mhm. Hiyo ndo kariya yako. Sure. So wewe umeweka kama kariya yako lakini mm-hmm. kariya yenyewe haikupatii chochote. Hakuna returns. So una struggle tu unafanya kazi kariya but hakuna kitu unapata from me. Mm-hmm. Before 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 things went south. Uh. Nini uli manageaje ku partner na PPNC ndio ukafanya hiyo song ya Kenya which was a big deal. Yeah, Kenya mm-hmm. had done it earlier. I had done it even I think one year before that time I met PPMC. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I just I mean I, was, I just wanted to do like a patriotic song and was hoping it can uh, uh, it can uh, do well someday. But nearly po record ni kaacha na tunaye. Okay. So even one year later when I met the PPMC guy and get and, and got to know about them. Mhm nikaambia mimi hata niko na song patriotic na labda naweza taka msikie muone kama ina make sense so when they listened to it they loved the song oh nice so that's when now they called me for for me to be part of the new you know, presidential uh I mean the new you know, the that my day mm-hmm. yeah yeah so uh, by the time i was getting to work with them it's a song i had done just kitambo oh, okay Yeah. Now so since then you still work with them um, uh, that was just it. Yeah, it, but uh, I recently worked with them on even a song for coronavirus. Mhm. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, they they gave me a yeah. So we've been working, we've been working when there's a project that needs artists that they you know they've been uh, reaching out to me to do the project with them, which mm-hmm. is a good thing. Yeah. Okay, interesting. Yeah. Now. Mm-hmm. We go on matters contemporary gospel Kenyan music. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm? uh, Today contemporary... we are talking about this guy doing this and that. Kesho kidogo kidogo amehama amesema hataki kufanya gospel anymore. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. yeah, it's a contemporary I think ndio ilikuja kwa to confuse pia kidogo. Okay. Because um what happened is a uh, uh, few years back Mm-hmm. We, we 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 wanted to be in a place of trend. Okay. Like what do young people want to listen to? What do my fans want to listen to? Ni watu gani na trend saa hii? No. Mhm. So we started diluting the gospel because deep gospel was not uh was not uh popular. Okay. Watu wengi wako wanapenda hiyo deep gospel maneno ya word ya god kabisa ile iko condemning ile ina correct unajua watu wanataka kusikia utu tu vitu tuna trend utu tu words words to uchinga uchinga na to dance song tunaamka leo tunaamua tuseme kanyo na tuendelee ya ya hizo hizo vitu vitu kama utu sasa wana anaeka hiyo ni gospel hiyo ndio i think ili to confuse to kwa sababu tulifuata bila audience inataka mm-hmm. instead of you know speaking to the place where you are called to be okay but you know something else there's no. one thing many people mm-hmm. lukiangalia sahi for you nitakuwa mm-hmm. <coughs> nakusifu lakini wacha tu kuseme you you've managed to keep a certain audience and whatever you do your music there's mm-hmm. an applause ile now this is what we call music what is it yeah. that you feel unafanya ni unique Uh, but I think for me mm. uh, I just decided I won't go this other way of contemporary. Mm-hmm. And uh, it took a lot of time for me to even be able to make those people believe in me. Mm-hmm. And of course it's not about me it is just the grace of God. Mm-hmm. That uh, that a, a certain group of people have chosen I mean have believed in my music and they have been blessed by it. Mm-hmm. So now uh, uh, I just uh, God gave me you know uh, uh, the, the grace to be able to maintain on those that believe in my music and, and those that feel blessed with it. I mean I didn't want to like go all the way to uh, to contemporary stuff so that I can be able to capture a big audience. Mhm. But I decided to just focus on the few that get blessed by my music. So it mm-hmm. it kept growing. It, it has been a gradual growth. Okay, interesting. 
Yeah. Now, what next for Guardian Angel? Because lately you've been on a spree. Tunapata ngoma leo, next week ingine, ingine. Do we have an album soon? <laughs> uh, um, uh, so, what, what I'm doing now mm-hmm. is, um, you know, I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't know that uh, guys would uh, really appreciate my new music. My, my, my worship mm-hmm. music. Mm-hmm. So, just a minute. Okay. So, uh-huh. um, uh, but I, I recently released a worship song. Sorry? I recently released a worship song. Mm-hmm. And it was a cool touch. Yes. I don't know if you know about it. Yes, I don't know it. <laughs> So um, uh, so from there, and even the response that I got from that song, I thought, mm-hmm. why not do a worship album? Mm-hmm. So I'm going to do a worship album that I will involve uh, other worship artists. Okay. Yeah, like four or five worship artists from this country and two artists from, uh, Zim- one from Zimbabwe and one from South Africa. Okay, so I'm going to do a worship album. Mahendere. Mahendere. Mahendere from, uh-huh. from Zimbabwe, uh-huh. and the other one is called Mukulu, Mukululi, Mukululi from uh, South Africa. Mukululi from Ali South Kwanga Africa. Alikwanga Hill song, I think, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Na Kenya, nikina nani? Oh, Kenya, saki kumenchen kwa sababu wa tuja ungea badu. Oh, okay. Kwa sijione tu wameandi kwa jina na sija wambia. True, true, true. <laughs> Uh, so Kenya could have few, but what I have in mind is Iblin Wanjiru, Eunice Njeri, mm-hmm. um, Eric Smith, okay. Frank Mutakati. So those are the ones I have in mind. I've mm-hmm. not spoken to them, so mm-hmm. uh, that they shouldn't just see themselves. Okay, so we'll just yeah. mention few. We'll say few Kenyan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Sawa and Mishkuru. Mm. Thank you so much. Keep doing what you do.